Well guys, Rick Dam here with Alumni Outdoors. We got uh, a newest addition to the sled for this upcoming season and I wanted to break down a little bit and show you what we get in the box for a Garmin 73SV Ecomap Fish Finder. This happens to be a new side scan model that they have. It also includes some down scan imaging and has GPS. So I'm really excited to put this in the boat today because what this is going to provide is the ability to up my kokanee trolling game and trout to be able to see more fish off to the side of the boat or in correlation to where my gear is running you can see where the schools move off to the side. Really an awesome, awesome product. Cabela's actually had this on a really nice sale so I picked myself up one. I'm going to run this in parallel with a current Lowrance um, HDS5 so I can run the mapping on the Lowrance and run the side scan and the 2D fish finder sonar on the Garmin and run those together. It's going to be a great setup. I can't wait to get this in the boat today. Like I said, really want to show you guys then what this looks like when you unbox it. I'm going to pair this up actually with a ram mount given the current setup I have for my boat the ram mount is going to be working great to mount this correctly and so I'll show you that here So, like I said got a ram mount ready to go gonna put this on the side of my current composite figuration for the Lowrance then this will be able to be mounted on the bottom and rotate up and down to fit the fish finder where it needs to. But let's take this apart and see what we got inside the Garmin Ecomap 73SV. So as we take this apart what you're going to first see is what's included. As you open up the box the first thing you get to see is the actual fish finder itself. 7 inch model from Garmin. Really good looking fish finder everything there definitely got more screen it's gonna be so cool to have this thing on the boat set that off the side you also are gonna have a flush mount template for those that want to mount it directly to the boat you're gonna have your owner's manual another a set of instructions for your fish finder and support notes and then in the bottom here, you'll take out the cardboard. You're going to end up having the actual mounting unit, which will go to the bottom here of this ram mount, just like so. It's going to look really good. So we got the mounting unit. power wires some additional wiring some adhesive backings for keeping your cable management and the big guy here at the bottom is going to be the rest of your hardware and the big transducer with the cabling so a really neat unit I can't wait to get this in the boat today we want to show you guys a little bit of what you get and we'll go about the process of me putting it in the boat so just watch and stay tuned here and we'll show you the rest alright guys we're out here on the boat now and I wanted to show you guys how we mounted this remember I talked about the ram mount well I was able to fabricate this with the ball and socket joint straight to what I already have for my Lorenz GPS unit that will go inside of here this arm, if I loosen it, I can freely swing it. I can do really well however I want to position this. Makes it really nice. Lock her down. And she's ready to go. All the cords, cables, everything's there. Just like that, we're ready to rock and roll. So it's going to make it a really convenient and easy way that I'll have the sonar and side scan right on that Garmin. And the Lowrance up here in this slot will end up being my GPS so best of both worlds but I love what this new Garmin has to offer so hope you guys can go check them out they may still be on sale 
if you can find them at Cabela's. So I would highly suggest go checking them out in store, if anything, to get an idea of what they can do. So thanks for watching, guys. Rick Dam with Homeboy Outdoor signing off. Take care and fish on.